got to help me. I can't help you, mister. That's way out of my jurisdiction. My job is stopping folks from getting shot on these streets. You know that. She's my wife. She's my goddamn wife. They'll, they'll do terrible things to her. You've got to help me. Maybe these people can help you. Them? Sure. Why not? Most lost and kidnapped folks are found by bounty hunters and such like. Will you help? I'll pay. Handsomely. <sighs> Wonderful. Wonderful. Yeah, Allison is the sweetest girl. She's quite a bit younger than me, you'll see. But better that way for wives, I, I, I found. But they took her. The outlaws, I believe. Up, up, up to Twin Rocks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you!
Sam, we got a body here. I'm gonna hang up your damn hide. Uh, nowhere to turn now. I'll thrash you good. Protégés, huh? He sent word you was decent. I hope so. This land is full of scum. I spend most of my time thinking they're better off left to it. Ah, they're good uns. Real good uns. Hard to pure cold. Go away, old man. I told you to go away. I'm going, Mr. Marshall. I'll go. Tom Davies, U.S. Marshal. See? I'm going. Been sent on a trail of a band of killers. I I'm still going. This one, uh, Alfredo Montez. Killed a family up near Thieves Landing. Did some unspeakable things. He's one in four states and two countries. Now I think he's holed up near Manzanita Post. You take a ride with me to take a look? All right then, let's go. You at your horses? Yep, follow me. I got a man been tracking him. When I left him, it looked promising, but we all know a trail can go cold in a heartbeat. Particularly if the one you're tracking don't want to get tracked. Fortunately for us, signs point to Mr. Alfredo Montez not carrying one fart. Y'all got bows, something like that. Get them off your horses if you do. Now, I cannot be seen to get too close to any of this. I'd be causing a crime or whatever the damn law is. Now, the thing is, is, uh. Well, anyway, here's Lee, the fellow we're supposed to meet. Hello, Tom. Uh, friends, how's it going, Lee? Yeah, Montez is Wiley. You know it and I know it. 
He knows we're coming, Tom. He's holed up and they're waiting for us. Place is crawling with guards, patrols, everything. It's gonna be tough, you know? Mm. Well, that's what I pay you all for. <laughs> Paying us to do your job. Lots of tracks going up here. Men coming back and forth. Camp could well be close. See that? Enough game for an army. Let's pray they stay thinned out, and we can pick them off. If they group up, God help us all. Big group ahead. Figure out how you want to handle them. They can go down at once, or one at a time when the others ain't looking.
Hold riders. Take them down or let them pass. It's all the same to me. There's a fair layering of tracks there. Heat shortened means the riders were slowing down. They is almost where they was going. And so we come on. I can feel it.
Here, here he is. He's dead. You know what? All we need is the bastard's head. Come here. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. <sighs> okay. Anita, I got a head to give to the marshal. his head. Oh. Very civilized. Yep. <laughs> well, this should show folks that we're willing to bring law and order any way we can. <laughs> but this ain't Montez. Hmm? At least it ain't Alfredo Montez. That's his brother. Ah. Here's some money. Lee, here's yours. You lot, here's yours. <sighs> it's less than I promised, but more than nothing. Given that you killed the wrong brother, it's mighty generous to me. <laughs> now, let's be clear. Jorge Montez was a no-good son of a bitch with a price on his head. Only in that family was he considered a saint. All right, friends. I'll be seeing you. Maybe up in Van Horn, if you have any chance. <laughs> My next lead is that maybe uh, Alfredo Montez will be there. <laughs> Kill the wrong goddamn bastard. Well, I never. Well, these things happen, Lee. In fact, they happen more often than we like to admit. <laughs> 